Today, I'm gonna to show you how to explode your lead generation and income on Instagram by implementing these four strategies. Look, there's no point putting a ton of time and effort into trying to grow your audience on Instagram or any social media platform if you then turn around and ignore the lead generation and monetization side of things. You'll end up like the Twitter influencer who had millions of followers but couldn't sell 20 shirts. In fact, I myself was this person. Back from 2015 to 2017, I grew a ton of different accounts and collectively had well over a million followers, but I knew nothing about turning them into leads and sales for my business. So I made very little income for a whole heap of effort. This was until 2018 where I decided to find people who were awesome at the business end and I would in turn grow their audience, plug it into their business, and that's when things started to do really well. This was the first year that I started generating a good income because I figured out the lead generation and sales part of the equation simply by partnering with these people. So today I'm gonna to save you the years of hassle and trial and error that I had to go through and show you what works for me and my clients in 2023 to turn followers into leads and clients using a helpful tool called ManyChat. Now they have reached out and sponsored this video to be completely transparent with you however it's a tool that i've been using well before they reached out and happily pay for it so let's dive into it and the first one that you want to start taking advantage of is called comment automation now you may have seen this across many platforms it's super effective and it's one of those tricks that will always work regardless of what year you're watching this video regardless of even what platform that you use what you're going to want to do with this is create a piece of content with the goal of driving sales. This could be a direct ad, like a story asking people to swipe up and message you a certain word, or it could be a reel where you sit down and, and you explain whatever your offer or promotion is. For example, I could create a story or a reel where I say, this month we're taking on five new clients and helping them gain 10,000 followers or more in the next 90 days then instead of sending people off the platform to a funnel, a website, a link, whatever it might be, what I'll do is I'll ask them to comment, say Instagram as a word or IG or growth, which then will trigger a message from ManyChat to send them the information and open the conversation. Now this helps in a few different ways. First, the increased amount of comments on your posts from people requesting information will lead to better reach of your promotion, which naturally will lead to more people registering their interest. That's often one of the downsides of posting ads in your feed on social media is because people engage with them a lot less, they get a lot less reach. However, if you get people to comment to show that they're interested in what you have to offer, all of a sudden Instagram or Facebook or Twitter or LinkedIn or, or whatever the platform is, we see a ton of people commenting and they're going to push it out to more people. The second benefit is by keeping people on the platform rather than sending them off the platform to an external link usually will mean that Instagram will push your content to more people. This is somewhat a conspiracy theory although it does make a lot of sense and it wouldn't surprise me if instagram punished people who sent people off the platform in fact i saw one creator say that mentioning the words link in bio will lead to a 33 percent decrease in the reach of your content now take that claim with a grain of salt because he didn't leave any references there however based on many years of experience it is pretty accurate that there is at least some form of restricted reach when you send people off instagram same goes for TikTok, LinkedIn, Facebook, etc. And then the third benefit to this is that by handling the sales over the DM rather than an automated funnel, you can get more personal and figure out what problems your audience have and how you can better solve them, which should lead to converting a lot more sales. So by switching your call to actions from click the link in my bio to comment this word for more information, you're gonna get more people comment, which will lead to much better reach. You will keep people on the platform, which will also lead to better reach. And then with that additional reach, you'll get more leads. And by handling the sales over the DMs, instead of sending people off the platform, you should convert a lot more of those people, which all of a sudden leads to a lot more sales for your business. Now, the way that you're gonna set this up in ManyChat is simple. I'll put a tutorial up on the screen now. Okay, so diving into my ManyChat account, if you wanna set this up for yourself, it is very simple to follow. All you have to do is come over here to automation down on the left-hand side. Then from there, you're gonna click on new flow. I use this one here. They give you a pre-planned template, but I'm just gonna get rid of that and show you how to build it yourself from scratch. This is the trigger action. So when user comments on your post or reel, you can set it to be any post or reel or a specific post. So if you just create one piece of content, 
that is an ad, then you can have it just that specific one, or you can have a keyword that you use across all of your content and then you just have everything. So any post or reel and the comment contains specific keywords. So it can be any words or you can choose it to be specific. So the keyword we might include here is 10K IG. So if someone puts that keyword into the post, it is gonna send them a DM. They will first reply to the comment with, thank you, please check your DM for more info. So we're gonna save that. So anytime someone hits that trigger, 10K IG on my post, it is gonna trigger the next action, which is gonna be an Instagram message. And this one we will say is, hey, following up on your comment, can you tell me a bit more about what you need help with? So this would be a good response if someone was inquiring about our services. That would be all we need. They're then going to reply to that message telling us what they need help with. I can then jump in personally and based on what they say, give them help point them towards one of our services, point them towards my course, or maybe point them towards my free content here on YouTube. So super simple to implement and uh, we'll get into the next point. Before going further with this video, I wanna be clear that ManyChat is a meta partner, meaning that they work with Facebook and therefore this tool is not at any risk of getting your account restricted, limited reach, shadow banned or banned like what may happen with other third party tools and what has happened in the past. In fact, it's quite the opposite. By using something like this, it'll increase the amount of interactions on your page which should lead to better reach in the algorithm and help you grow faster now the second tool that you want to implement is conversation starters you know how on instagram you can set up prompts for people who message you this makes it a lot easier for people to reach out which naturally is going to lead to a lot more leads and sales while on many chat you can take this a step further and set up multiple replies so for example if you go to dm me on instagram the prompt i need help growing my business on social media can you help is going to pop up and if you click that i can set up mini chat to then respond with a message along the lines of potentially can you tell me a bit more about what you do then when you respond to that mini chat can reply again on my behalf with something else such as what are you struggling with the most which then automates a good part of the basics to which i can then get in there see if we can help that person or if we can help you and run from there with a solution or sending you in the right direction this straight away saves a ton of time and helps gather more information on potential clients this tool also comes in handy for e-commerce businesses if you want to automate your customer support you can set it up so that it automates the process of people asking about their shipping information or order updates and all of that again i will put another tutorial up on the screen in a moment to walk you through how to do this on mini chat so back into my mini chat account i'm going to show you how to do the conversation starters this one takes a little bit more setup than the previous one but it's still very straightforward so this is going to be the messages that pop up when people go to message you and you're coming up with responses to those messages so instead of just offering people three options when they go to dm you you can actually create a response based on what they say so if they choose one of those three you can then have a personalized response depending on which of the ones they choose which then points them in the right direction so for example i can have four different options in here and so one of them is people are asking for help about instagram the second one is a prompt for people needing help with youtube the third one is a prompt for people struggling to monetize and the fourth one is a prompt for people to go to my youtube channel so any of these four reasonably common questions that i get and so i just need to go through and set up responses for each of these so i've set it up so that when a user sends a direct message with the keyword i need help growing on instagram which is the prompt they were given many chat will then send them a message saying can you tell me more about your current strategy and goals with instagram to which point i can then come in look at their goals and strategy and help them come up with a solution to achieve that and become a client of our business if we can help them then all you have to go back through and do is repeat the process for the rest of them so i'm going to create a new message so that when someone hits the trigger of growing my youtube anytime someone sends that message we will send them the response can you send me your YouTube URL so I can take it at your channel? Also, what's your main goal with YouTube? And so anytime someone asks about YouTube, they then send a different message. Can you send me your YouTube URL so I can take a look at your channel, please? Also, what's your main goal with YouTube? This way, we can funnel people, find out about their channel, get a bit more information without me manually having to do that. So it saves me a ton of time. And then lastly, we'll quickly set one up for this here. So what is your YouTube channel link? So keyword YouTube channel link. So anytime someone sends that there, 
here's my YouTube add button open website then I'm just gonna put in my YouTube URL we're gonna call it and just like that we've now set up the three of those four questions so can do the fourth one later but now if people ask me about any of these they're going to get a response straight away to collect more information which we can then use to speed up the process and generate more leads for our business and if you want to follow along mini chat have given a free 30-day trial to anyone who watches this video which is an extension beyond their usual 14-day free trial on their website so if you want to take advantage of that you might as well i'll leave a link for it down below now the third strategy you can dive into to generate more leads on instagram is going to be click to message ads now this product is actually labeled as CTX or click to message ads. Not sure why on the abbreviation there. And these are ads that you can run and instead of sending people to an external website to find out more information, you encourage them to message you. So for example, if I use that same video I talked about in the first step with the comment automation, which went along the lines of this month, we're taking on five new clients and helping them achieve X in the next X amount of days, DM me the word growth for more information. I could then pay to have meta push this out to new people and it would likely perform well for a few reasons one you've got a really specific offer two you're taking advantage of the mini chat feature or just in general getting people to comment on your content and then following up with them and then on top of that because this is a new ad product from meta it's likely to be a lot cheaper in the short term if you're watching this 6 12 months down the line it may not be the case but if you're relatively early i would definitely jump on it i'd again then use mini chat to automate part of the follow-up giving these people something of value for free asking them more about their business and then getting them to book a call with me so that we can hop on the phone and see how we can or can't help and then finally the fourth part of this video is going to come back to an age-old piece of advice that you've probably heard a ton of times collect more emails you've probably noticed a ton of experts recently are stressing the importance of collecting emails from social media nowadays even in my most recent video i talked about it building your email list gives you the ability to contact your audience without needing to worry about the algorithm them, provide additional value to your audience that you simply can't do on a social media platform and it is a platform that you own meaning you can't get banned or restricted with the click of a button like you could on any social media platform which is actually becoming more and more common you see more people randomly get banned myself included earlier this year my account is gone for a full month and if I didn't know the people I know I probably would have never got it back if I'd pushed my audience to join an email list I would have then been able to contact them regardless the business would have been fine I could have just set up a new page, sent the true fans over there and rebuilt relatively quickly. Now, again, you can build an email list the normal way by simply sending people to a landing page from your social media platform and then just asking them for their name, email address, etc. However, you could also use ManyChat's new feature to be able to collect their emails in the DMs without sending them off the platform. What you're first going to want to do here is to create something of value for free that you can give away in return for an email this could be an ebook a discount code a pdf a video training free access to a tool etc you'll then have to choose an email marketing provider such as aweber active campaign mailchimp beehive there's a lot of ones out there to look at as well figure out one that fits your needs upload your free training to this and then you're going to want to connect it to mini chat and then again we'll jump into my screen i'll walk you through how to set it all up so for our last automation that I'm going to run you through today is going to be collecting emails using mini chat bit of a sneaky way to do it a lot more effectively whilst keeping people on the platform all you're going to do is click on the email build an email list in Instagram template and then that is pretty much going to set it all up for you so as you can see here when a user sends a direct message with the keyword ebook then it is going to trigger this event Hi, thanks for reaching out. We are excited you are interested in our content and ebook. We would love to send you more. To get a free ebook, please leave us your email below, to which it will wait for a reply from the contact. And then if the contact has not responded, it is going to set up with a follow-up message. Hi, are you still there? If you are interested in getting a free ebook, please let us know your email below. And then once they respond to either of those with their email, follow-up message will be sent. Awesome, you're all set click to grab your ebook so the email has been collected and then you can either tell people to collect the ebook in the dms or you can say you are all set check your inbox to access the ebook 
if you do it that way it can avoid people putting in like a fake email to try and get access and then you might remove that button and then as you can see here if you click on here and look at the action on reply the reply type is an email save email to system field and then this is going to sync up with your email autoresponder so for me i use convert kit so it'll put that email straight into convert kit into my funnel where i can then send them a free guide send them a free video and add them into my email sequence where i will then send them follow-up emails giving them additional trainings and helpful useful information for free and then potentially funnel them back to my business where we can offer them more help to scale their audience, scale their income using social media. So that's the last one. Let's dive back to the video. Now, the overarching theme to most of these strategies is actually pretty straightforward and comes back to a few simple concepts. Firstly, the more you keep people on Instagram, the more Instagram will reward you with reach, same as any platform. So if you switch to promoting your offers over the DMs instead of external funnels, spend your advertising to send people into the DMs instead of an external website, and even collect email subscribers in the DMs instead of a landing page, this will lead to better reach. On top of that, the more people you get to engage with your content, the more reach you will likely get. And this is why you want to encourage more people to reply to your stories, send you DMs or comment on your posts as it will spike the activity on your page and lead to better reach, growth, engagement, leads, everything. When you pair up more reach on your content that is specifically designed to generate leads, then naturally you're going to get more leads and more sales. Now you could do this manually, although to help manage all of this additional activity, it is likely a good decision to bring on the help of a tool like Minichat, which can do more of the mundane tasks so you can focus on what you do best, creating great content, serving your audience, and providing a better service for your customers. Thanks again to Minichat for sponsoring this video. I'll leave their code down below if you wanna get a free 30 day trial. And then I've also linked a few other free trainings that I've put together, running you through how to grow your audience on social media to make all of these habits more effective. So again, down in the description. Other than that, I'll see you next time.